Hello, Marina. Good evening. How are you today? Good evening, teacher. Hello, welcome to the class. How are you tonight? Hola, sí, lo voy a hablar en español. Ok. Pero no ha entrado acá nadie, solo yo. Oh, here is Jonathan. Hello. Ahí entraron. Hello, good evening. Good evening, chef. How are you? Uh, I'm... Thanks. Okay, Teacher. excellent. So you say you are fine, you are good, you are bad. Yeah. How are you? Tell me, I how are you? I'm going fine. I'm going fine. I am fine. I'm going, 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 going fine. I am going fine. Um, we say I am fine. I am uh, fine. Yes, I am fine. Or well, yeah. I am good. Mm -hmm. okay, okay, teacher. El verbo feel. I feel. I, I feel I excellent. Feel. I, I feel, feel excellent. I, I feel, feel perfect. I feel very good. Me siento bien. Yes, you're right. Me siento bien. I feel. Okay, how was your day? Tell me, how was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo su día hoy? Trabajado. Ah, okay, it was very busy. It was very busy. Fue un día muy ocupado. Very busy. Very busy. I worked a lot. I worked a lot. Yo trabajé mucho. I worked a lot. ¿Cómo se escribe eso? Es que ese, ese, lo voy a hablar en español. Eso es lo que a mí me confunde. O sea, yo entiendo más estar viendo escrito que hasta lo oyendo. Ah, ok. So we need to practice listening. So I work a lot today. Eh, here is the sentence in the chat. You're going to see it in a second. So I worked a lot today. Yo trabajé, sí yo trabajé ah. mucho el día de hoy. In the question, how was your day? How was your day? It means, ¿cómo estuvo su día? How was your day? Okay. So the answer is, it was. It was relaxed. It was relaxed. Teacher question. Estuvo sí. relajado. Yes, sí. tell me. What is your question? It was, uh, it was. I was, it was busy. Tell me. Teacher, este, disculpe, este, este, hay grupo de WhatsApp en, aquí en esta clase. Es que no me han agregado, perdón. Oh, really? Yes, we have a WhatsApp group. Okay. I'm going to send you the link. Just a second. Okay, thank you. Thank you, teacher. Chat. Just give me a second. Uh, so let's let's continue with the class. I'm going to send you the link in a minute. So welcome, Alpha, Julio Valle, and Jonathan, Mario, Jose, Leonardo, Morena, and Luis. Welcome to the class. It's a pleasure to be with you tonight. It's nice to see you today. So tell me, how are you? I'm very tired. Very tired. I'm sorry to hear that. So you're going, you're going to go to bed and rest a lot at 9 p.m. So just be strong. That's okay. One hour more. One yeah. hour more. Uh, Julio, how are you? I am very tired. You are tired too. I'm just sorry to hear that. In Alpha, Alpha Baca, right? I feel headache. Oh, you say I have a headache. I, I have a headache. 
I have a headache. Uh, can you give some advices to her? Can you give some advices to Alpha? ¿Cómo? No lo entendí. Sí. ¿Pueden darle algunos consejos a Alfa para que se mejore? Ah. Um, sí. Maybe she takes an aspirin. Ah, ok. Take an aspirin. Take an aspirin. Any other advice? Any other advice for her? Help her. Take an aspirin is a good one. Any other? Any other advice? Um, no, no more advices. Oh, we are everything everybody. Sorry. Drink no. a tea. Okay, drink a tea. Drink a tea. Um, a cold tea or a hot tea? Which one is better? Um, hot tea. Oh, drink a hot tea. Very good. It's another advice. Okay. Uh, before to start the class, do you have any question about the platform exercises? Uh, problems, questions, doubt? No, no questions? No. Okay. I, I finish. Uh, 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 mid midterm, midterm. Oh, you have already finished the midterm. Very good. And what about the rest of the class? ¿Cómo van? ¿Ya llegaron al midterm? Al midterm, yes. Yes, okay. So yes. section one, section two, yes. section three, and the midterm. Yes. And this week, we need to take the midterm at the end of this week, right? So tomorrow we are going to have a review of these three sections, and then you're going to be able to take the midterm, and then we're going to have a feedback of that midterm. So if you have any questions, don't hesitate, please don't hesitate to write on the WhatsApp group. Yesterday we were studying preposition of place. Do you remember some of them? Preposition of place. We use preposition to locate places in a city, for example. On. On is one, excellent, on. Any other, do you remember some of those prepositions that we studied yesterday? In front of. In front in, of. Okay, very good, in front of. In front of. Next to. Across next from. To. Across from, in. next to, very to. good. Between. Can we? Between is the other one. Between. 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 On the corner of. On the corner of. That is uh, one. Wrong. I'm wrong. The corner. On the, cor on the, the corner, corner of. of. Excellent. Any on other? The corner of. Any other? Preposition. Behind. Oh. Okay. Behind. Behind was missing. Very good. Yeah. So today we're going to have, um, let's see, let's start with tonight's topic. And today we're going to, we are going to, we are going to study the topic given direction. We are going to learn how to give direction. For example, cuando alguien le pregunta, excuse me, eh, how can I get to the hospital? ¿Cómo puedo llegar al hospital? So, oh. eh, y usted dice, oh. ah, camine dos cuadras, gira a la derecha, el hospital está enfrente del supermercado. Eso vamos a aprender el día de hoy. Va, usted dice, váyase recto por esta calle. Váyase derecho. Váyase oh, derecho. Street. Ok, walk on Main Street. So we are going to learn that tonight. Next to the school, next to the, I don't know, next to the bank, next to the hospital. Okay, very good. So I'm going to share my screen with you. And this is topic. Welcome to the class number seven. So giving direction. Giving direction. What is the meaning? Just a second. Um, let me know if you can see it, please. 
Are you able to see my screen? I see your screen. Okay, thanks a lot, Walter. Let's start then. Okay, look at this. I have this map. Which places can you see in this map? City Park. City Park. City Park is one. Yes, which other one? A daycare center. City daycare center. City Elementary School. Okay, very good. Any other? Right. Daycare center. The daycare center. Okay, look for the place in red. What is that place? The place in red? What is it? Fire station. Fire station, very good. Fire Which station. are the places in purple? Bakery. 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 And City High School. City High School. And City High School, excellent. And which are the places in pink? Beauty shop. Beauty shop. Beauty shop. Beauty shop and a store. Grocery store. Grocery store. Okay. Which are the places in orange? Orange. Video store. Drug store and barber shop. Video store. Yeah. 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 The the coffee, ha coffee shop house. Coffee house, library, and coffee police house. station. Library. In, in green, which are the places in green? City Park. City Park. City, City Park. Park. Okay. In light green? McDonald's. McDonald's. Okay. And also the, the bank, right? Which is a kind of green. Very good. Things are out. So look at this conversation. Excuse me, I need to buy some medicine. Can you tell me where they is? If this person wants to buy some medicine, which place is he or she looking for? A drugstore. Okay, let's see if you're right. Yes. Drugstore. Can you tell me where the drugstore is? Excuse me, I need to buy some medicine. Can you tell me where the drugstore is? Yes, the drugstore is, the on, is on Shore Avenue. Avenue. It's on Shore Avenue. Está sobre esta avenida, ¿verdad? Se llama Shore Avenue. Sure. Across, sure. across from the library. Cruzando la biblioteca. Between the fire station and the bakery. So let's see what is the drugstore. Let me see what is the drugstore. Okay, here is the drugstore. It's on Shore Avenue. Está sobre esta Short avenida Avenue. que se llama Shore Avenue. Between, between, between. Avenue. Avenue. In the bakery. Between. Between the bakery. Between. 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 Okay, the, the bakery. I need two volunteers tonight, and I'm going to choose Luis and Alpha. Can you please help me? Alpha, you are going to be A, and Luis, you are going to be V at this time. Can you practice this small conversation, please? Excuse me. I need to buy some medicine. Can you tell me where the drugstore is? Uh, yes, the drugstore is on Short Avenue, across from the library, between the fire station and the bakery. Excellent, excellent job. That was great. It was awesome. Very good. Thanks a lot. So let's see the next exercise. Let's go with the next. Look at this. This is my conversation. Can you please help me? Can you please tell me? I am looking for the. Do you know where it is? Why not? Sure. The, it's on Back Street. Look at the, direct, the direction. It is on Back Street, just south of the elementary and middle school. What is the place? Is the barbershop, the city park, the courthouse of the city high school? It says it's on Back Street. 
está sobre la calle que se llama Backstrip, just south of the elementary and middle school. Here is the south. Acá está. The south is el sur, en el punto cardinal. So we have north, west, east, and south. So which one is the place? Norway. City Park. City Park. No, the city no. park is at the east. Mm. Try, try. Tell me when. Barber shop, city park, courthouse, or city, city high school. City high school. Okay, city high school. Alpha. Yes, you're right. The city high school. It says it's on back strip. Está sobre esta calle que se llama back strip. Eh, just south of the elementary and middle school. Justo al sur de la escuela eh, primaria y la escuela. Very good. So is this city high school. I need to volunteers and at this time I'm going to choose Walter and... Adonias, can you help me, please? Walter, you are going to be A, and Adonias, you are going to be B. Okay. Yes. Um, can you please help me? Uh, I am looking for the city high school. Do you know where it is? Why not, sir? The city high school is on Back Street. Just sound south of the elementary and middle school. Excellent job. Okay, thank you. Okay, very good. That was outstanding. Thank you for your thank help. You. Thank you. Thank you very much. You did a very good job. Let's go to the next. Look at this. Uh, can you help me? I am looking for the, sure you can find the, um, is it the same between the barbershop and, and oh no, it's another one. Sure, you can find it on back strip between the barber shop and the daycare center. Which is the place? Beauty shop. Beauty shop. Beauty shop. Beauty yes. Shop. Yes, beauty yes you're right. Can you help me? I'm looking for the beauty shop. Sure, beauty you can shop. find a beauty shop on back strip between the barber shop and the daycare center. I need to volunteer to practice this small conversation and I'm going to choose Jose Leonardo and Luis Armando. Can you help me, please? At this time, Jose Leonardo, you are going to be eight. And let's see. Okay. Luis, Luis, you are going to be B at this time. Okay. Can you help me? I, I am looking for the beauty shop. Sure, you can find the beauty shop on Back Street between the barber shop and the daycare center. Thank you. Perfect, very good. That was excellent. Very good pronunciation, guys. Thanks a lot. So can you help me? Very good. Let's see the next. Let's go with the next. Could you please help me? My car is missing. Where is the? They is on the southwest corner of Long Avenue and Back Strip. It's on the corner of Long Avenue and Back Strip. Y nos dice la dirección, ¿verdad? El punto cardinal, southwest. Police station. Police station. Excellent. It's the police station. This person is looking for the police I'm station. I'm sorry, guys, but I'm taking my dinner right now. I'm sorry not to be with you. Okay, don't worry. Enjoy no your meal. Enjoy your meal. Good lunch. Thank you very much. So could you please tell me? My car is missing. Where is the police station? The police station is on the southwest corner of Lone Avenue and Bath Street. I need to volunteer to practice in this conversation and I'm going to choose Jonathan and Senia. Can you tell me, please? Jonathan, you are going to be A and Senia, you are going to be B at this time. Okay, teacher. Okay. Could you please, could you please help me? 
My car is missing where is the police station. The police station is on the southwest corner of Long Avenue and back street. Excellent. Thank you very much. Very, very good job. Thanks a lot. Here I have another example. Hi, I have a bad cough. Could you please tell me where the is? Sorry to hear about that. You will find it on the northwest corner of Border Avenue and Front Street. Which place is this person looking for? City Clinic, Bakery, Grocery Store, or the City Park? Baker Center. Daycare Center, mm -mm, I'm sorry. That is not the right answer, but very good try. City, city Clinic. Excellent. He is looking for the City Clinic. City, city, city Clinic. clinic. Where so, is City Clinic? So. Oh, oh, you can corner off. Yeah, this person is sick. So. Next to the. What's the matter with her or him? What's the matter? What's wrong with him or her? What's the matter with this person? What's the matter? Why is she looking for the city clinic? She is a cop. Ah, okay, she has or he has a bad cold. This person he has, has a bad cough. He has a bad cough. Ok, como la mitad del Salvador en este momento, ¿verdad? Tiene una tos, ¿verdad? Yo, una terrible tos. tos. Ok, so, oh. hi, I have a bad cough. Could you please tell me where the city clinic is? Sorry to hear about that. Oh. Siento Thank mucho you. escuchar eso, ¿verdad? Siento mucho escuchar que estás enfermo. You will find the city clinic on the northwest corner of Border Avenue and Front Street. So northwest is this way. Northwest is this point. Northwest. That's this. In this corner. City clinic. I need to volunteer to practice in this last conversation. And I'm going to choose Nestor and Isidro. Yeah. Isidro, can you help us? Come on, Isidro, come on. He's eating, he said, right? Uh, Luis, can you help me instead of Isidro, please? Hello, Luis. Okay. okay hi, I had a, I, I had a bad, a bad cough. Could you please tell me where, where the city clinic is sorry to hear about that you will find the city clinic on the northwest corner and border avenue and from the street okay excellent that was excellent very good practice thank you guys you did a very good job so let's go with this i guess this is the last one so it says hello could you tell me where the yes yes there is a cross from the city park and next to the city clinic. And this person is looking for the city middle school, bakery, daycare center, or the grocery store. This it is a cross from the city park. It's a cross from bakery. the city park and next to the city clinic. Bakery. Bakery. Okay. Excellent. It's the bakery. Yeah. I need two volunteers who wants to participate at this time. Any volunteer? And me. Thank you, Julio. Julio and any other? Any me. Other volunteer? Thank you, Walter. So Julio, can you please start? And then Walter. Okay. Hello. How you tell me uh, where the bakery is? Okay, yes. The bakery is across from the city city park and next to the city clinic. Thank you very much. Thank you, Julio. Thank you, Walter. You did a great job. Great job. So bakery, hello, could you tell me where the bakery is? 
Yes, bakery the, is. the bakery is across from the city park and next to the city clinic. Very good, thank you. Okay, let's see. Tonight we're going to learn these two questions. How do I get to? How can I get to? We can use this, Yes, we can use this expression when we are looking for a place and we need help to find that place. So you say, how do I get to the bakery? How do I get to the supermarket? How do I get to the city clinic? How can I get to the school? How can I get to the gas station? So we use these questions to ask to another person for a direction. So you say, how do I get? How can I get to? And the answer, you are going to listen the following answer for this question. So walk up, go up, walk down or go down. Walk up and go up means eh, suba por esta calle, ¿verdad? Váyase por esta calle, suba. Walk down and go down is baje por esta calle. Y turn left, turn left on. What is left? Usa. Derecha o izquierda? Izquierda. Izquierda. Yes, you're right. Yes. Left is izquierda. Turn left on the... Y ahí el nombre de la calle, ¿verdad? Turn left on oh, Main left. Street. Turn left on First oh, Avenue. Turn oh, left oh, on oh, Second oh. Avenue. Turn right. Turn right on. Turn right is... Gire a la... Gire a la derecha. Gire a la derecha, ¿verdad? You can also see this on the right. The hospital the is right, on the right. right. The hospital is on the right. El hospital está a la... A la derecha. Derecha, muy bien. Oh, the hospital is on the left. Está a la... A la izquierda. izquierda. Uh -huh. Y esta otra frase que vamos a escuchar, oh, probablemente, ¿verdad? Go straight on. Go straight on. Eso es vaya recto, ¿verdad? Go straight on for two blocks. Camine recto por dos cuadras. So, any volunteer to read this expression? Walk up, go up, walk down, go down. Turn left on, turn right on. On the right, on the left, go straight on. And the question, how do I get to? How can I get to? And here in this blank, you are going to fill with the name of the place you are looking for. So look at this. Look at this conversation. It's, excuse me, ma'am. Can you help me? How do I get, how do I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? Just walk at Fifth Avenue to 50, 50th Street. St. Patrick is on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? Yes, it's right across from the Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And what is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. So which expression can you see to give directions? Conversation, is it far from here? And this is the question. How do I get to? ¿Qué lugar está oh, buscando yeah. el joven? Patrick's Cathedral. Okay. Just walk up Fifth Avenue. Camine, ¿verdad? Hacia arriba hasta la avenida número. Cinco. Cuenta. Cuenta. Avenida, avenida, hasta la quinta avenida. Hasta la quinta avenida. Hasta la quinta avenida. Tú. Hasta la calle número. Eh, calle número 50. Ok. St. Patrick's is on the right. Cuando llegue a esta calle, ¿verdad? va a ver que la catedral de San Patricio está 
¿A la izquierda o a la derecha? Está a la derecha. Ok, it's on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? Está esta cerca del Rockefeller Center. Yes. yes. It's right across from the Rockefeller Center. What is the meaning of across from? Cruzando. Cruzando, ¿verdad? Right? Cruzando. The Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And what is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? So near es cerca, far es lejos. Está lejos de aquí. Is it far from here? It's right behind you. What is the meaning of this? Atrás. Está justo atrás de ti. Just turn around and just turn around and look at. Just turn around and look at. Look at. Sorry. Look at. Look at. Oh, yeah. So we're going to learn those expressions here. Look at this map. Oh, we have here the gas station, bakery, parking lot, airport, hospital, supermarket, a park, jewelry, train station, museum, library, information office, bank, and restaurant. And the name of the street are Cardiff Road, Queen Street, Oxford Street and King Street. So King look at Street. King Queen Street. Street. So look at the direction and tell me. Good. Uh, acá está la Cruz Roja. Estamos parados acá. And this is the place in which we are right now. We are here. So read the direction and tell me which place um are you looking for it so it says wall along oxford street so look at this expression walk alone walk along yeah just a second Siga largo. I don't know. okay walk alone. walk alone is siga en esta calle or that camine a lo largo de camine a lo largo de oxford street is this one. It's next to the Jewelry opposite the train station. Which is the place? Is it the museum, the park, or the car park? Okay, sigamos la dirección. Give me a second, I'm going to choose this. The man is looking for the park. It's looking for the park. Uh, let's discover that. It says walk along, camina a lo largo yes. de Oxford Street. Vamos a caminar acá. Yeah. Then it says it's next to the Jewelry, opposite the train station. So I am here in front of the train station. So here is the Jewelry. It's next to opposite the, train the park. So this person is looking park. for the yes. park. So oh, this good. is the right answer. Very good. Excellent. Let's see the other okay. one. Okay. Yes. Let me erase this. And this is all my participation for this day. Thank you very much. <laughs> we have a lot of exercise tonight. So stay, stay in the class. So turn, <laughs> turn right and then take the first trip on the left. It's on your right next to the hospital. Which is the place? Estamos acá y la indicación dice turn right. Turn right. Turn right. Ah, caminando. Giramos a la izquierda o a la derecha. Turn right. Derecha. Derecha. Right. Y take the first trip. First. Tome la primera calle a la izquierda. O sea, vamos acá. Giramos a la derecha. Llegamos acá. Take the first trip on the left. La primera calle que encuentre a la izquierda, it's on your right, next to the hospital. Voy acá y dice, está a su derecha, a la par del hospital. ¿Cuál es el lugar? The supermarket. Supermarket. Oh, this person oh. is looking for the super supermarket. supermarket. Ok, try to guess the other one. 
Qual on this strip, walk past the train station, it's on your left opposite the car, the car park or the parking lot. Airport. The man yes. is looking for the airport. For the airport? Yes, that's it. Yes. Airport. Okay, okay, let's discover that. I'm going to raise this part. Just a second. And we're going to choose here. And let's go. So it says, go along this strip. Camina a lo largo de esta calle. Walk past the train station. Ya llegué a la estación de tren. So it says, walk past. Camine o pase de la estación de tren. Ya llegué acá. Ahora estoy acá en este punto. So it says, it's on your left opposite the car park. Eh, izquierda, acá, right? Opuesto al parking lot. So it's the airport. You were right. Thank you, Isidro. It's the airport. This person is looking for the airport. The airport, this is the right answer. Very good. Let's read it. Try to guess. Take the first turning on the right. It's on your right between the tourist office and the bank. Which is the place? Generally, restaurant or museum. Try to guess. What is it? Restaurant. The man is looking for a restaurant. Yeah, you're right. He is looking for the restaurant. Restaurant. So, leamos la dirección. Take the first. Tome la primera calle. Turning on the right. Esta es la primera. Giramos a la derecha. It's on your right. Acá está a la derecha. Eh, between. Between the tourist office and the bank. So this restaurant, is the place. Yes. Restaurant. Yeah. Try to guess the next one. Go straight on and take the second. Váyase recto. Tome la segunda calle. Eh, girando a la derecha. It's on the left. Opposite the hospital. Gas station. Station. Gas station. Gas station. Okay, oh. let's see if you're right. So you say the gas station. Go straight. Vaya recto. Acabamos recto. Take the second. Ya pasamos acá la primera. So we are here. Turning on the right. Turn on the right. Giramos a la derecha. It's on the left, opposite the hospital. Ya llegué aquí al hospital y sé que está opuesto al hospital. Then we are looking for the gas station. Very good. Now let's see the other one. Take the first strip on your right. Take the next strip on the left. It's on the right, next to the supermarket. What is the place? Hospital. Is it the hospital? Hospital. Okay, now as you say, it is the hospital. So let's see, take the first trip on your right. This is the first. Um, take the next trip on the left. Tomamos la siguiente calle a la izquierda. It's on the right, next to the supermarket. Está a la derecha, a la par del supermarket. Okay. Oh. Hospital. Hospital. Very good. Hospital. Okay, excellent. Do you have any question about this? Is it difficult or easy? Giving direction, is it easy or difficult? Easy. Very easy. So I have this uh, small conversation and we're going to practice. It says, good morning. May I ask may I ask you for some help? Sure. Could you tell me how to get to the post office? Could you tell me how to get to the post office? Walk on First Avenue, turn right on Center Street, 
Well, on one block, the post office is in the corner of Center Street in the Second Avenue, next to the hospital. So, esta persona está acá, en este punto. You can see this is here. So, the conversation says, walk on First Avenue. Va a caminar acá, in the First Avenue. Turn right on Center Street. This is Center Street. Then it says, wall one block. Block es una cuadra. Block es una cuadra. So, one block. Caminamos una cuadra hasta este punto. Then it says, the post office is on the corner of Center Street and Second Avenue. Next to the hospital. So here is the post office next to the hospital. So the second conversation. So I can find Al's coffee shop. Is it near here? No puedo encontrar la tienda de café que se llama Al's. Is it near here? Está cerca de aquí? No, it isn't. You are far of that place. No, no está cerca. Usted está lejos de ese lugar. How can I get there? How can I get there? ¿Cómo puedo llegar ahí? Y acá están las instrucciones. Go straight on Center Street. Acá, go straight on Center Street. Then turn right at Second Avenue. Turn right at Second Avenue. Turn right at Second Avenue. Go until you reach Main Street. Main Street. You will see Favorite Shoes Shop. Estando en este punto, ya voy a poder ver esta tienda. ¿no? Favorite Shoes. Then, Al's Coffee Shop is next to Favorite Shoes Shop. It's here. It's here, right? Next to the favorite yeah. shoes. Okay, I need to volunteer to practice the first conversation. Excuse me, excuse me teacher. Tell me, is there is a new uh, word for me. Tell me, what is the new word for you? There is a new word. There is a new word for me. Which one? Tell me, what is it? Hello, what, does, it, what does it mean? Uh, rich. 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 Go uh, until you reach. Okay, hasta que llegue, hasta que alcance. Reach. Hasta All right. Hasta llegar, como cuando decimos en Salvador, hasta yeah, llegar a. Hasta llegar a. Yes, in this case, yes. Thank you very much. Okay, any other question? Give me, give, give me whatever you want. Uh, maybe a chocolate. Do you like chocolate? Yes, I like. <laughs> no, not much. Not much. <laughs> not so much. Okay. Not so much. What about beers? Just a little. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so two volunteers to practice the first conversation, please. Who wants to participate? Tell me. I want to participate, teacher. Okay, Isidro and... Yeah. Your... Thank you, Alpha. Thanks a lot. So, Alpha, you are going to be A, and Isidro, you are going to be B at this time. You can start, please. Oh. Thank you. All right. Okay. Good morning. May I ask you for some help? Sure. Will you tell me how to get to the post office? Okay. Walk on First Avenue to right on Center Street. Walk on one block. The post office is in the corner of Center Street and Second Avenue next to the hospital. Excellent job. Thank you. 
Very good thank pronunciation. You. Thank you, guys. You did a great job. Thank you. Thank you very much, teacher. I need another uh, two volunteers to practice in the second conversation. Any volunteer? If no, I'm going to choose someone. Me. Me. I want to participate. Okay, Part thank you. Luis and Julio. Yeah, me. <laughs> Yes, okay, thank you. So, Luis, you are going to be A, and Julio, you are going to be B. You can start, please. Okay. Thanks a lot. Okay. I can find all coffee shop. Is it near here? Uh, no. It isn't your far of that place. How can I... How can... Oh, excuse me. How can I get there? Uh, go straight on Central Street, turn right at Second Avenue, go on until you reach Main Street. Uh, you will see favorite shoes, shop, or coffee, coffee shop in next to favorite shoes shop. Thank you. Okay, excellent, very really good job, thanks a lot. So let's see, um, imagine that I am here. I am in front of favorite shoes and I want to go to the parking lot, which, di which direction I need to follow. Can you help me? How can I get to the parking lot if I am here? Can I help you, sir? Yes, please. Okay. Listen, pay attention, please. Go up on Second Avenue. Go up on Second Avenue. Then turn on the right, on the left. Go, go, yeah. Mm, go up on Second Avenue and turn left. ¿Cómo se dice? Váyase largo. Se me acaba de olvidar. You can use go up, go up, up go up, go stripe, go, go stripe. Go stripe. ¿Qué? Teacher, dijo una palabra que es váyase hasta el tope o a lo largo. Go long, no sé. Go along. Go work along. Work long. Ok, go along, o oh, podríamos decir este, walk for block, por one block. Walk for okay, one, walk one block. On Central Street, walk for one, one block. block. Okay. On Main Street. Eh, the parking lot, is it um, across from the department store? Okay, and the good. corner of first or main. Okay, very good. But here, aquí, todavía podíamos dar una dirección más, ¿verdad? Y turn left on First Avenue para llegar hasta aquí, ¿verdad? And you say the parking lot is across from the department store. Okay, very good, but very good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Good job. Now let's change the place. I'm going to raise this. Now imagine that I'm in front of the movie theater and my car is out of gasoline and I need some gas. So I am here in front of the movie theater and I need to reach to the gas station. So how can I get to the gas station? How can I get to the gas station if I am here in front of the movie theater? Someone can help me. How can I get to the gas walk, station? Walk, right? What right? Well, go on Main Street. On Main Street, yes. Right or left? Main to Street. The left. Go. Go left. 
go and left on Main Street. On Main Street. And oh, door yeah. or left? Turn to the right. Okay, I'm here now. I am here. Door left? Yes. Teacher, vaya, vaya haciendo la raya para que se vea educando. Go on Main right. Street. To the left. Turn so left. Then turn to the right. I am here. Right and or left? Yes. yes. Right. Turn right. Turn right. right. Okay. Go on one block. Okay. The next station is in the corner. Walk, walk on one block. Thank you. In the corner of on, what? Which street? On the corner of. In front of the house, the corner of uh, Center Street and First Avenue. Ah, okay, very good. Thank you. So you say across from the hospital. Here is the gas or station. Across from the hospital. Okay, now I am here. Acabo de estar una semana acá en el hospital and I want to go to the park. So can you help me, please? <laughs> ah, Dios nos libre, nos guarde. Okay. <laughs> Okay, let's me read this. Um, I am in front of the hospital. How can I get? How can I get to the park? Can you help me, please? I think oh. I I walk one block on the. Um, no, walk. Go straight on. Go straight. Go straight on center, center strip. strip. Okay, I'm going straight on block, center. One block on the on the right. Turn, 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 turn right. Right. Turn, turn right, right on Second Avenue. Yes. On on second Avenue. Avenue. Okay. One block. One block. Um, block. Turn, turn right. Turn right. On Main Street. Turn right again. Main Street. On Main Street. On Main Street. Turn right. Okay. Turn right oh. on Main Street. On Main Street. Uh, in front of Regency Movie Theater. Across, across. Okay. Regency, Regency next Movie to, Theater. Next okay, to next the movie. Movie. Movie here. Okay, very good. Thank you. I'm going to take a shower on that fountain. Very good. Okay, thank you very much. You're right. You say uh, walk or uh, go straight on Center Street, uh, turn right on Second Avenue, turn right on Main Street. The park is uh, in front of Globe's department store or the park is across from the movie theater. Uh, do you have any question about this? We need practice more. Okay, don't forget about this, right? Walk on, work on, so turn right. Which is the other one? It is turn right, turn left, go up, uh, walk up. Go down, walk along, go along, walk along. Walk and which other one? Eat on the right, eat on the left. So we use all those expressions to give directions. Go straight. Okay, questions? Do you have any questions? Then let's see, don't forget, please, that this week we have the midterm test, the midterm exam. So we need to complete or to take this exam. So don't worry if you, um, let's see, make a mistake. Uh, if you don't know the answer and it is bad at the first moment, you can take it again. Lo puede hacer de nuevo, ¿verdad? No hay ningún problema, eso no le quita puntos. Okay. So, so let's see. Um, let's uh, have a review of the expression that we learned today. 
uh, what are the two questions that we need to use para pedir ayuda y encontrar un lugar? How do you get to? The first one is, how do I get, get to? How do I get to? And you say the place, right? How can I get and, to? And the other one is? How can I get to? Okay, excellent. How can I get, get to? to? And then we have here the place in this one. So how do I get to? How can I get to? Then uh, you can use this, right, to introduce, excuse me, and then the expression, excuse me. How do I get? How do I get to? How do I get to? The place and the question mark. Very good. Eh, otra frase que puede utilizar para introducir la pregunta es Can you help me please? Can you help me? Can you help me please? Oh, could you help me? Oh, could, could you help me? me? Uh, la diferencia entre can y could es que could es más formal. ¿verdad? Could you help me okay. please? So, y después dice la pregunta ¿verdad? How can I get to in the hospital, for example. El Salvador. Okay, El Salvador Hospital. <laughs> it's fashion. Muy. ¿Y cuáles son algunas posibles frases que podemos usar para dar direcciones? Which are some phrases that we can use to give directions? Walk right. Okay, walk well, right. Walk up. Walk up. Walk up. Or walk yeah. down. Depende, ¿verdad? Si la calle va para arriba, sería walk up. Walk up. Si es una bajada, you say walk down. Walk up, go down. Also, we can use the verb go. Go up. Go up. Go. Up. Go. Go down. Go down. Go down. Which other one? Which other one we can use? Tell me. Turn right. Okay, excellent. Turn right. Turn right on. Right on. Oh, left. Okay, we're good. Turn, Turn left. left on. Which other one? Walk, walk long. Walk go, along. Go, go, go straight. Okay, go straight. Go straight. Go straight. Very good. Any other? Do you remember any other? Walk along. Okay, go up for one block. What is block. the meaning of block? For one, for one block. What is the meaning una of cuadra. Cuadra. block? Cuadra. Okay, una cuadra. Una, una cuadra. Very good. Questions? Do you have any questions? No questions? No question. All clear. Okay, okay, very good. So just practice this, right? On the platform, you're going to find some videos with some explanation and you're going to have the chance to practice, right? To practice these phrases. So if you don't have any other question, just let me show you this. Okay, one second. The me turned. Ya saben dónde encontrar el me turn. Because yes. you, are, you are going to take it, right? So let me see. So section, let's go with sections. You are going to find the me turned right after the section number three. And this is the me turn exam. Me turn. Yes. It has one, two, three, four, five, five exercises. The first one is a listening. The first one is a listening. So you have to listen to the conversation and check the correct answer. You are going to play here in case that you that it is not start as this 
pledging, you can click on this. You can click on this and another web page is going to display in this part. And you are going to listen here. You can play here and it is going to work. So just in case it isn't working here. So you listen, you check the right answer and don't forget, right? Cuando ya ha marcado una de estas opciones acá, se le habilita acá la opción enviar. When you have finished the exercises. So look at this. So you push on this button, click here. Sure. And your answer will be saved. So the next one, the next part is match the question with the answer. So you are going to match this question with this answer. And we're going to work this weekend. You have to choose the right answer here. And you have one, two, three, four, five, six, six exercises. In the next part, and then you are going to select WH question to complete the conversation. Here, you are going to choose the right. So here is the answer. You have to look for the question, the right question. Or the correct question. Yes, the right question. Very good. Right. And the next part, complete the conversation. You are going to select here one of these bear to complete this conversation. So it says, I, a headache. And then drink it or take these pills. So choose one word to complete this small conversation. And in the last part, you are going to read. You have to read this article, which is called Home Remedies. Do you know some home remedies? Conocen algunos remedios caseros? Home Remedies. Yes, yes. take a hot soup. Okay, chicken soap. Uh, which other way? Um, hot tea. Miel de abeja. Miel de abeja. Té caliente. Okay. Té caliente. Okay, very good. So then this is the mid turn. So good luck. Good attend. Buena suerte. Que tengan 10 in, in el primer intento. Teacher, yo creo que. La primera y la segunda unidad, eh, cuando tú dices eh, eh, marcar abajo de enviar, yo creo que la primera y la segunda unidad, todas las respuestas las hice, pero, o sea, me salieron buenas, pero no le di a enviar. Ah, ok. So... De, de la una a la dos no recuerdo exactamente. Yo creo que no le daba a enviar, simplemente veía la respuesta que estaban, que estaban buenas. Um, ok, pero, so don't forget about ya, this. Right? Ahora sí, ya toda esa ya la hice y ahora no olvidé enviarla. No sé cuánto vamos a sacar de nota, ¿no? Ok, so you can check here. Uh, que hay una pestaña que dice progreso. Sí. Vas a aplazar, Chidro. <risa> Fíjate que bueno. en, en, ahí, en el, ahí en el progreso todo está al 100, la primera y la segunda unidad. Y I lo am... que es todo lo que el teacher acaba de explicar, ya hoy lo hice, ya está. Vaya, entonces tiene que reflejarse la cámara. Si hizo la Triple sección 1, <ríe> excelente. Si hizo la sección 1 completa, toda esta barra va a estar llena. ¿no? Ok. Acá. Si hizo la segunda, es esta. Si tomó el examen. Debe de estar, ¿verdad, Ticho? Eh, check it. Revisen, Ray. Revisen. Okay. Gracias. Eh, el el midterm acá, ¿verdad? Es esta barra de acá. Midterm. El midterm, acá tiene que estar al 100%. Si lo completó, si no, aquí va a ir teniendo 70, 80%. Y este, okay. es el examen, este es el examen final y aquí está el total. La suma total de sus notas. Very good. So if you don't have any other question, eh, buena suerte en el midterm. Don't forget to take it during this week. Eh, see you tomorrow, Ray. See you tomorrow at 8 p.m. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Good All night. Perfect. Good night, Good everyone. Night. Bye bye. Good night. See you bye -bye. tomorrow. Bye -bye. See you tomorrow. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Ciao, ciao. Bye -bye. Oh. Luis, do you have any question?
Hello, Luis, do you have a question? 